What up guys, I'm jumping on the low snap here. After today, I'm gonna rant a little bit, I'm gonna tell you why I hate being a Dolphins fan. You're up at 17 to nothing. And then they give up a field goal, it's like, oh, okay, that's not so bad. And then Ryan Tannehill proceeds to just throw two bonehead, dumb, like weird interception plays while he's trying to avoid pressure. I understand Laramie Tunsil was out, and that's a huge blow for the offensive line because that is replacing now your left tackle, your left guard, and your center from different points in the season, but you're up 17 to nothing. Um, part of this is on Adam Gase, the head coach. Just <laughs> the type of play calling, like you know the protection wasn't really good to start with, and it got even worse and adapt your play call accordingly. But Ryan Tannehill, I mean, he's a guy I would like to describe as close. I mean, he, he could be a great backup quarterback in this league, or like a fringe starter, but nothing that'll get you over the hump, nothing that'll ever lead your franchise to multiple Super Bowls. And it, it's frustrating. I don't know what the Dolphins are going to do. I hope they explore other options. They can actually get out of his contract pretty pretty nicely um, this off season. I hope they seriously look at Drew Locke, or if Dwayne Haskins comes out, look at him as well. Clayton Thorson wouldn't even be a bad option in the mid-rounds as well. Um, just, I hate being a Dolphins fan, especially after today. That's a game we had won, dominated for about two and a half quarters, and then just pissed it away. It's like, give the ball to Frank Gore. Do what you need to do. Just basically don't throw two interceptions to give it away. Take a knee every snap and just punt it. It's frustrating. This is why I hate being a Dolphins fan.